Hello everybody and welcome back to Slay the Spire Downfall! This is, what, part 22, 23, 24? I don't know. Part 22 is probably gonna end at 23 or 24 or just... Hang on. <laughs> I need to check. <laughs> I've committed. Okay, it's part 22. Um, and depending on how well the run goes, it might stretch all the way to part 23. Who knows? Today, if the game won't lag... Let me... Here we go. Okay. Why is it so laggy today? I have no idea why it's so laggy right now. Okay, but in any case, today we're doing watch. Again. Now, seriously, what is going on with my game? I don't have all that much running in the background. It's literally, it's OBS, Steam, and the game. That's all that's open on my laptop right now. And it is super stuttery. Hopefully it'll get better as I go, because I did just switch on my laptop as well. Okay, today's watcher. Um, hopefully the run goes well, because I don't particularly like playing watcher. <laughs> um, so, I've been doing some thinking. And basically I'm just filling in the void while the game loads. There we go. Okay. So I've been doing some thinking, and mm, I might do Watcher and then Hermit for the base game characters. Because I do still need to beat, like, win a run with Ironclad and Defect in order to unlock a specific thing. Um. So that is going to that is part of my goals still. So what's my options? Obtain a random rare card, max HP, obtain a curse and gain gold, or obtain a random boss relic for for my starting relic. Um, what's my map look like? Two super early shops back to back. One to elites, but a lot of fights there. Uh, I can go up that way as well. So I think that's what I'm gonna do. Okay. So obtain a gold curse. Okay. So that curse is going to be in my deck for a grand total of one fight. <laughs> Because at the next shop, I am just removing it immediately. What is going on right now? I legitimately have no idea why my game is lagging so much. I think the game just crashed. Now? Hasn't crashed. Not yet, anyway. I, I'm, I'm seriously, like, super afraid that it is going to just crash at one point during the run. And yes, I still have the very bad cough that I have had for past few recording sessions I've done. Um, I don't know how I'm gonna get rid of it. Eventually it, it should go away, that's why I have a, a bottle of water next to me or a cup of coffee next to me constantly. 
because I have noticed that um, whenever I drink uh, and whenever I drink some water or something it helps with the cough it helps to prevent me from coughing which is really handy okay I kind of want to go for a mantra build but I have no idea how I'm gonna do that because I don't know how many mantra cards I have unlocked but okay I'll, I'll, I'll take brilliance because it's 12 damage really nice uh, fury of blows no 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 okay cool so let's continue onwards to the next fight. Start off with eruption, followed by strike. Okay. Let's see how badly this is going to end. Quite well because I did not take a single hit there. Cool. Um I guess slash Slash whip? Uh, I really just want to get this character over and done with. And put a miracle, shuffle with sort of violence. None of these are helping with my current build. <laughs> Reach Haven. Deal, deal 10 damage, shuffle a throw violence into your draw pile. A zero cost card for 2 damage? For 20 damage? Not 2. I don't have enough for both of these. So this is effectively 30 damage, this is only 20. I can check the upgrade. So 26. And 15, so that goes. I'm gonna go for the reach heaven because yeah. that's way more damage than the than the other card. Okay, brilliance, reach heaven. Apologies about that. Um, let's end turn. Okay. No violence. Ooh. Pressure points. Always pressure points. Okay. So now my thing is I can go upgrade, upgrade, rest, upgrade. Or elite upgrade. I think I'm gonna go elite because I need to. I, I have zero relics right now. I definitely need the relics as soon as possible. Okay, so smash whip, pressure point, block. End turn. Yeah. Okay. Yes. 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 That. Cool. This fight hurts. Not gonna lie. Uh, that. I don't have enough damage to kill this turn, but next turn I'll be able to. Should be able to. Five. Dang it. <coughs> okay, there we go. We're good. few hits, we're good. Uh, none of those. Oh, an upgrade shrine. Perfect. Um, let's upgrade. Pressure point. 
There we go. And then rest, because I just got my upgrade. One treat! Shop! Why did my voice crack? <laughs> um. Ooh, follow-up could be good. He says, looking at a completely different card. Follow-up is deal 7 damage. If the last card played was an attack, gain an extra energy. But Smite is also good. I'm going to take the follow-up, and if I can afford it, I'm also taking the Battle Hymn. Because Battle Hymn is really good passive damage. <laughs> Wait... Yeah, somewhat passive damage. Um, yeah, I should be fine for another elite. Yeah, gremlin knob. Fine. We're fine. This might not pressure points. Um, this is the one fight I will avoid pressure points in. Uh, because of the fact that he gains, he gets stronger if you play skills. Power cards are fine, but if you play a skill, he gets stronger. And I don't want him to get stronger. So do that, do that, smite. And then next turn, I should be able to kill. Yeah, because I have a throw violet. There we go. Easy! Barely took any damage. None of these, thank you very much. <laughs> skip, skip, thank you. Then I want to rest. And as long as neither of these are combat, I'll be able to uh, rest at the last one. The serpent basically. I'm not going to reread it. Um, he basically asks if the greatest thing in life is gold, and he, and if you agree, he gives you a bunch of gold. Wheel of Change! I have not read this one, I've skipped over the text every single time. You come upon a dapper looking cheery gremlin. It's time to spin the wheel. Are you ready? Of course you are. Play. So, the rewards. Damage, remove a card, remove curse, heal, relic, or gold. I think I've gotten the relic like twice in my life. <laughs> uh oh, you lose. You spot him readying a shiv. I lose 7 HP. Yeah. You slash at the crazy gremlin, but he's simply too quick. He gets you a few times with a crude shiv. Shiv. The price has been paid, and with ba that, both the gremlin and the wheel disappear in a puff of smoke. Let's see. Um, I should be fine if I upgrade. Yeah, get that him in eight. It's a lot of damage. Yes. Okay. Then push points. Okay, I should have drunk the potions first. Uh, yeah, I'll that. In turn. So, four strength. It makes me hit quite a bit hard. Quite hard. Quite a bit harder. Quite a bit harder. So the, those are the words I was looking for. Hopefully I'm fine here. Uh, do smite follow up slash whip drink the miracle bot potion use both of them play the calm and then end my turn. That should work. Oh. Yeah, that works. 
Miracle. Hmm. <coughs> Ow. Ah, uh, is the only thing I can say there. Ten, hang on. Twelve, twelve, seven, ten. So, one hit and he goes down into the defensive mode. Because he just needs four damage and he shifts. So I'm looking for the optimal amount of damage here. It seems to be 12. And then do that, end my turn. Okay. Defend pressure points. Uh. Thorough violence, end turn. See, this is where Smite picks up. So, 11. Okay, so that's 16 times 3 is. 16 times 2 is 20, 30, 32. I can play smite, smite, and then anything else, and he's dead. Perfect. Okay. Was not thinking that this fight is going to work out. I am taking judgment without even considering the other two. Oh, Ragnarok is actually quite tempting. But I'm taking judgment, because I'm noticing oftentimes all I need is just for that tiny smidgen of health below 30 to go away and then I'm going to take busted crown yes black star is good but I need more energy because of stuff like wheel kick and reach heaven and eruption and vigilance that's the one not calm what do I call it calm okay busted crown 